All right, so I'm going to be backing up an N64 game from the original cartridge uh, using the Retro with the N64 adapter, which I just got today. So it's fairly simple. The Retro hooked up to the PC with a USB cable and the adapter for the plug-in. Hit the reset button on the Retro. And... Uh, and looking up at my screen here, we should be able to. One second. Should be able to capture the ROM off the off the thing, unless of course the cart may be dirty, and in that case it may not find it. I should have checked that before I did this, and I did not get the ROM file. I got generic ROM Sega slot dot dat. Um, it's very possible I may need to clean this cartridge. I never tested the cartridges after cleaning them. So, uh, yeah, I think I may have to clean this one. All right, let's try a different game. Uh, let's see, what's the game? Okay, let's try this one. Killer Instinct Goals. There it is. Okay, so here's the ROM file right here. This is the retro config, so if you want to have the controller be read as something else. This has controller ports for the N64. You can use your original N64 controllers. And we drag Killer Instinct over to my little N64 backup folder with all my other N64 backups. And then it will copy the, uh, the ROM file into the folder there. And also, I guess if you have the controller pack, the uh, save, you know, the whatever to, for your saves. If you have that, you plug it into the controller, plug the controller in, and it can actually read those save files as long as you have it updated to the latest firmware. And then you can copy those save files off the pack, I believe. I'm not sure. I don't have a, a, a save uh, thingy, memory thingy memory card, whatever. Got some garbage. Throw it out. Okay, so now we have saved Killer Instinct Gold to this folder. We have now five ROM files backed up here, and here is Killer Instinct Gold right here. So, we can now play that. I'll have a few games to clean again. Um, so that's going to be cool, but, uh, do it one more time because it's fun. All right. Let me rip one more game. The Killer Instinct back. We'll rip one more game if I have a clean one to rip. Um, let's see. We have Aereo Gouge. Here we go. So I have the... Uh, I can't really see. Right. Aereo gouge. Making sure it's recording still. Pop the game onto the thingy there. Hit the reset again. Whew. Tired. Okay, so let's pull up... Uh, Get out of here. Funny. Uh, it did not actually uh, work there. Try that again. There it goes. And there it is. Aerial gouge. So, your aerial gouge on N64. I'll get that out of there. And we drag and drop it into the N64 folder. Yay, fun! So now we're backing up our original cartridges. 
I've also done this with my Sega Genesis and SNES cards, as well as my 32X cards. Oh, and I'm going to show something at the end. Fun, fun, whatever. Which involves it. 32X. Okay, here's a 32X game, Star Wars uh, Arcade, and uh, originally this, uh, the Retroad, does not in fact, one second, there you go, right there, okay, originally the Retroad does not uh, work with 32X games unless you have the 32X adapter or you take the whole retro apart, whatever. But I have modified the um, retro to fit a 32x game. Hold on one second. Again. Let's see if that's bright enough. Uh, okay. So normally a 32x game would not fit into the retro. However, there you go. I have modified the opening to fit a 32X game. And then go back up. Seems good. And we can actually see that there is an SRAM file and a star and the um, the 32X bin file. And we can actually just take that and drag it, drop it. I don't need to, I've already done it, I'm just showing it. But we can just, like I said, you can drag and drop it onto the desktop, and then you can back up your SRAM and save uh, and your ROM files to the desktop. And that's that. So it was just fun, 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 whatever. So that's the retro, and that's the way to back up your your ROM files off of the actual carts themselves. So yay. And I'm just going to delete these files because I don't need them. I already have them backed up. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Alright, thank you for watching.